What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the vlog. Um, this is six week number 15. I know you guys probably hear um, Boss Baby playing in the background because Sahara is watching Boss Baby. This is her favorite show. She loves to watch Boss Baby while she swings in her swing. So that is what she's doing right now. Today is Monday, um, February the 22nd. It's around 11.30. Um, we're just finally getting up out of the bed. Um, I'm about to get ready to make me some coffee so I can do a little bit of like planning and stuff on my computer because I do want to film some videos tomorrow. I think I'm going to go to my mom's tomorrow to film um, her baby haul like with some of her clothes that we have. So yeah, that's what we're doing right now. We're just chilling out. These are my flowers from Valentine's Day. They're actually dying. <laughs> Because it's a week later, but yeah, they were really, really pretty. Zale got me these flowers. So yeah, but now we are back at home. I think I talked about that in the previous vlog. We're back at home. Hi, mamas. You want to say hi to the camera? She can see the camera. <laughs> she got the peace sign up. Can you say hi to the camera? Yeah, she knows when I'm blogging, so... I'm about to just go ahead and make me some coffee and chill out. We're not really doing much today. Um, I'm trying to not make my vlog so long. My last vlog was almost two hours. I think that was because I had like a previous week included in that vlog. So yeah, but I'm trying to do my best to... Um, that's probably I'm trying to do my best to like stay on track as far as like vlogging throughout the week. So yeah, that's why I was like, let me pick up the camera and update them. So yeah, I'm not really doing anything, about to just chill out, y'all, you know, just doing mommy things, um, and just prepping for this week, and yeah, so I guess I'll update y'all in a little bit, I'm gonna get myself together, I just got this mommy bun in my head, but yeah, I guess I'll update y'all in a little bit, um, come below and let me know what you guys did this Monday, so, yeah. What's up, y'all? Today is um, Wednesday, February the 24th. Um, I'm not doing anything. I'm literally chilling out. Zahar is sitting here on the couch asleep. Um, yeah, she's knocked out. She put her hands up. Mm. Hey, baby. Oh, she woke up when she seen the camera. <laughs> you woke up when you seen the camera? You say hi? Say hi. <laughs> yeah, so I was just sitting right here, right next to her. Um, I have her lounger here on the couch. I was sitting right here next to her for everybody who's wondering. Like, be careful with her on the couch. But yeah, I was sitting here right next to her watching her. Um, so yeah, it's around like... 341 is almost like four o'clock. Um Zill should be home soon. Zill should be home soon. I'm gonna cook some turkey burgers tonight. I cooked tacos last night, but I'm going to cook some turkey burgers tonight. I just pulled the the turkey meat out of the fridge because I forgot. So yeah, yeah, mommy's talking. You hear mommy talking? So yeah, I just wanted to update y'all. Um I don't really want to bore y'all too much. Um, I didn't vlog yesterday because I literally was not doing anything yesterday. I was literally just sitting here chilling out um, with her. I literally was just sitting here chilling out with her. Um, yeah, and I've been doing like a lot of research for Timeless Takara because I... Um, I need to actually purchase some new inventory. I need to actually mark down some stuff on my website that has not been selling. So I need to do some markdowns. And I'm kind of just like trying to like revamp um, Thomas Takara. Um, and get motivated to like get back into the groove of things. Um, yeah, you hear mommy talking? She really likes when I just sit here and talk to the camera. Everybody really thinks she's going to want to get into film, too. I was like, she probably will. Uh, maybe we do some baby auditions. Yeah. We do some kid auditions. Yeah. But, um, 
yeah so i've been just writing down i did a um a poll not a poll i did a questions on my instagram stories if you guys aren't following me on instagram you definitely should because i i kind of post on there often um but i did a question on my instagram and asked everybody what is your guys's um what is your guys's spring summer covid what is your guys's spring summer pandemic attire going to be because you know we're still in a pandemic so i want to know are you guys going to just be lounging around in hoodies i actually need to buy a whole set of new clothes um like i need to buy more cute little lounge sets and stuff like that so i've been thinking like okay what type of stuff can i put on the vintage shop so i've just been like shopping around on wholesale sites and looking for wholesale vintage and also um just looking up different wholesalers online um different vendors online that i can order from because i really want to get like i know a lot of us wear like um biker shorts like i well i don't have a i know a lot of us wear biker shorts i don't have one anywhere right now i have on shorts but i wear biker shorts a lot because it's just comfortable and that's like an old school biker shorts are like an old school like 90s style so i feel like it would fit with my vintage shop um graphic tees i love wearing like the washed um uh t-shirts um like oversized tees or like band tees things that have like really cool prints on them so i'm been looking up different stuff um different type of inventory stuff a lot of you guys said sets and dresses so yeah i just been looking up like different inventory to add on to the shop um i haven't really been doing any like filming and stuff like that which i really need to do um but i just y'all i really haven't been in the mood like i told zale the other day i was like yeah like i feel like i'm not really doing anything like every day i was like the days are just going by i was like i hope i'm not like sad or like have postpartum depression or anything because i was like i feel like i just don't want to do anything like and he was like you are doing something he was like you're taking care of your daughter like you're watching her grow every day and he was like you are doing something like you're basically like i am kind of low-key like a full-time mom and i have to take care of her so when i keep that in mind i kind of not kind of don't get too hard on myself when i'm not doing like my business stuff because i'm like at the end of the day i'm like staying busy with zahara so yeah she's looking dead at me like what are you talking about yeah i'm staying busy with you so you keep me so busy you keep mommy so busy and alive yeah so yeah that's pretty much it i am like i said writing down stuff if you guys aren't following my business page um it is timeless takara at timeless takara on instagram and on facebook you can like me on facebook if you have a Facebook, share my business page with your friends and family. It definitely helps me out a lot. And check out my website. It's www.timelesstakara.com. I sell all types of vintage stuff. And, like, I'm going to be including more, like, retro stuff. Like, more, like, I want to do still auntie style, auntie vibe, vintage. But also, like, including the more modern, like, streetwear vintage in there as well so yeah i'm thinking to add more of that so i've really been looking up um like i said wholesalers for more like retro stuff um more streetwear stuff i guess you can say because i feel like a lot of us wear more like streetwear vintage um i wear both i like like the old school like auntie vibe vintage and i also like streetwear so um yeah tell me which one you guys prefer in the comments below um or if you're just more of like a biker shorts um graphic tee type of gal like streetwear that technically is like streetwear vintage so yeah um i'm just gonna continue doing that zahara is sitting here on her lounger yeah she was taking a nap but then she woke up because she heard the camera she heard the camera time was on she's usually in her swing but today she was kind of fussy in her swing and i don't like to just sit her in the swing like i know she doesn't always want to swing so I just sit her up here with me in her lounger. Um, we just kind of like rotate back and forth. I, my mom has her a play mat at home. Um, I want to bring it over here or buy my own. So that way she can get like tummy time and stuff like that. And she can have like um, floor time. And I also have a box. Um, it's this Love Every box. I don't, I have to do like a, I'll have to show you guys. Maybe I'll show you guys a little. I'll have to show you the box. 
but it has like these cards and stuff that she can look at and stuff like that so i actually need to pull that box out um so she can kind of like play with that um yeah i just want to get her like more toys i'm thinking about um getting her like one of those little seats where she can sit in it and it has the toys in the front and she can like play with the toys in the front and like kind of like it'll help her like sit up and stuff so i'm me thinking about buying that off i think they have them on amazon so yeah thinking about buying that as well um and i also need to get the rest of my sewing stuff that's what i was meant to tell you guys before i um leave is i need to get my sewing stuff because i told y'all i want to do more sewing videos i see a lot of people are referring back to my sewing series like there's my sewing series videos have been blowing up since the pandemic it's crazy um a lot of people don't have my kim moore machine i mean a lot of people have my kim moore machine and a lot of people can't find tutorials on my kim moore machine so i felt like that would be the perfect opportunity for me to make more videos um since a lot of people are discovering that machine or having that machine but they don't they can't discover any videos with that machine so i'm thinking about um i'm not thinking about i am going to be making more videos with the sewing machine um and like i said i need to get into the groove of making some sit down videos so whatever video ideas you guys have for me put them in the description i have loads of video ideas i just have to push myself to do them i get just really like discombobulated it's crazy like i'll wake up and then i'll be like okay what am i doing today and i'm like mm, okay i'm just gonna research but i gotta get out of that like researching phase and just like getting her together and then filming like how i did with my labor and delivery video um which i was really happy that i got done um but yeah you know this this is this mompreneur life is very different it's not really too much different i feel like i'm getting back into the groove with her um it's just different okay it's just different um but yeah i feel like i have less stress on me because i get to still be at home um you know i don't have to go to work that go to a job every day drop her off at daycare and stuff like that. i have the privilege to be able to be at home and still do my creative work which i like and she's really not a bad baby at all like she's really just wants to be changed um she likes looking at me when i'm talking to the camera because she's looking at me right now um she likes watching her little shows but i don't really know if she understands it but um and she just likes to eat be nursed or whatever and she really likes to sleep she takes her little naps and yeah and that's really it she's really not a bad baby um yeah you're really not bad like i could probably get a lot done if i just get like i said i can get a lot done if i just balance everything um and just get a little bit more organized so yeah practicing that and oh and like i said i'm gonna i'm gonna bring my sewing machine and get my sewing station set up and things so i can get into the groove of those videos um i had to go to the grocery store yesterday and i forgot to get my sewing machine and all of like my sewing stuff out of my trunk when i went to the gro when i went to my mom's house to drop her off to get groceries so i had to just leave my stuff at my mom's so that i could go to the grocery store and i'll have room to put my stuff in the trunk and because I forgot to bring it, take it out of my trunk and bring it in the house here. So I'm going to have to go back over there. Probably go back over my mom's tomorrow to go see my mom. Because she likes, my mom really loves to see the baby a lot. Um, but yeah, so I'll probably go get that stuff tomorrow. Um, I have a few other things that I actually need to bring home too. Like my vintage stuff. And I did sell some stuff the other day which i'm trying to figure out um how i'm gonna go to the post office because i have her like i told my mom i was like maybe i can wear my carrier and like take her in the post office and it'll like get her out but i'm really don't want to take her out anywhere because it's still COVID. she still can get sick you know what i mean so usually i just let like to either let my mom watch her or sell or whatever or my mom just was like um i'll just just package up whatever you need and i'll take it to the post office because my mom usually has to go to the post office too i don't i'm not re, i'm not renewing my um p.o box i don't know if i should because i don't know dude, i don't really feel like 
I need the P.O. box because I'm like, I don't feel like nobody's really writing me any letters or anything like that. I feel like that's kind of old school. If you guys wanted to write me, you guys could just email me nowadays. I know P.O. boxes were big back in the day. I thought about keeping it because I thought about if you have like a small business and you wanted to send me something and I promoted it. Uh, but I just told myself if that's something that you guys wanted to do, then I could just go back up there and buy the box again. Um, because I had got the box for I think six months or something, or almost yeah, six months or something. But I got the box for because um, I knew you guys were going to be sending stuff for like the baby and stuff like that, and it just made it easier to send it to the PO box. Um, because I didn't just want my address out there for all to see. So, yeah, that's why I got the box. But, yeah, I might think about opening it back up just depending on how I feel. Um, so, yeah, and I have to email somebody back because there's actually a girl who has a small business that wants to send me some stuff, too. So, um, because it, Zahara has eczema, and I actually have eczema, too, and she was telling me how she has some products that could help her out. So, yeah, I'm definitely excited to about that and work with her so yeah if you guys have a business or anything like that and you ever wanted to send me some stuff you definitely can contact me email me my email is in the description box below or if you're just a business that wants to work with me um like i said all my information for like sponsorships and everything yeah if she wants me to rub her feet is in the description box so yeah i think i'm going to finish doing what i was doing i just wanted to update y'all for the day we're literally not doing anything isn't that right? Isn't that right? We're literally not doing anything. Look, baby. Look. She's like, I don't want to look. I want to look at you. Yeah, so we're literally not doing anything. Like I said, we're chilling out. Like, not chilling out, but like, we're just regular routine stuff. Getting, trying to get, I'm trying to just research. Um, and I need to order inventory immediately, like soon. Um because you know the spring and stuff is coming up like summertime is coming up and i know i feel like people are still about to be traveling during this pandemic i don't know i don't know tell me what you guys think but yeah um yeah that's really it um i guess i'll update y'all later yeah what is up y'all welcome back today is thursday february the 25th um yeah, I have not been really vlogging at all like that, but I wanted to come on here and update y'all. I did wash my hair, but I haven't done anything to it. So I'm this bodysuit and I have some sweatpants because I had to take a shower earlier. Um, Zahara is actually in our bedroom. She is asleep right now. It's about 6.54. I'm about to get ready to cook dinner. Usually I start cooking dinner earlier but um i don't know i've been cleaning up today trying to get things together so i'm just gonna cook some chicken um tenders i like these um i like to put these on like the skillet with like butter i don't think i have any honey i want to make just some little macaroni velveta i'm trying to think of what else i want to put with it um I don't know if I want to do the Velveeta or if I want to do the rice because I like um, cooking the rice with this chicken as well. So I'm trying to decide if I want to do the rice and do some broccoli. I usually do like mixed vegetables on the skillet or if I'm going to do the um, macaroni and cheese. I haven't thought yet. Usually I like make some mixed veggies with it. Um, or I'll do like broccoli. I don't have any broccoli. I do have mixed vegetables though. So I'm trying to figure that out. Um, yeah, not sure which one I'm going to do yet. I did successfully pump three ounces of milk today. So I have like a really small stash in here. I need to get my stash up. Once I get my stash up. I'll show y'all. I'm actually gonna do a breastfeeding video, but yeah, my camera's actually about to die, so I just wanted to update y'all. I haven't really been in the mood to vlog y'all, I'm not even gonna lie, so just excuse that. But yeah, um, that's Thursday. Not really doing anything 
been cleaning all day because I'm just trying to get back in the mood. I'm, I'm in a real funk. And you know, like when the house is a mess, you feel a mess, you feel like your life is a mess. So yeah, that's just what I've been doing. Just been organizing the house and things of that sort. So yeah, I'm gonna get ready to cook and I guess I will update y'all tomorrow. So yeah. Oh, what's up y'all? Um, today is Saturday, the February the 27th. I have not gotten the vlog up yet. Um, I'll probably post it tomorrow. Pretty boring vlog. I really didn't do anything this week. Actually, a really rough week. Which is why I'm about to go to the thrift store and have some me time. I am at my mom's. Um, we spent the night here last night. Um, yeah, I just have not been feeling it, you guys. So, my mom is actually watching Zahara. It's around 9 o'clock. Um, so I just told myself I'm gonna have some me time for like maybe like a couple hours, go to the thrift store and pick up, try to find like some new items for the vintage shop because I've been wanting to do that anyways and I've been needing to carve out time to buy new items. Um, so yeah, my mom has Zahara, Zahara's up right now. Um, my mom's about to actually give her a bath. I have her tub right here so I'm about to give her that to her. Um, I'll probably vlog on my phone while I'm in the thrift store and stuff and show you guys like what I find, what I'm doing and, 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 every, and what I'm doing and everything. Um, I also need to pick up Zahara some drift because she ran out of laundry detergent and I need to drop off some stuff at my mom's job for her and I also have and I also have a vintage shop package that actually needs to be taken to the post office um so yeah i need to do that but i have to package it up so i might have to stop by my house um so yeah and do that i need some vaseline on my lips but yeah so that is literally what i'm getting ready to do i just have on this top it's really just like a graphic tee basic tee um i have on some sweatpants and then my nike air force ones real chill real basic um i think i might go to two goodwills today there's a goodwill right here by my mom's and then i'm gonna go to there's another one on the other side of town near her job so yeah just gonna do that and then i will i guess hit y'all up in a few because this battery for my camera is actually about to go dead um i did make me some coffee as well it's 905 so they're probably getting ready to open or already open but um yeah i did make me some coffee so i'm about to pour me up some coffee real quick and then i'm about to get ready to go um i had pumped during the week so my mom has milk and everything like that so it was a hard should be good She's been itching a lot um, this morning, so I did give her a little bit of Benadryl. So I have a feeling that she takes her bath if my mom decides to give her some more milk. Um, she's going to be knocked out. Like, she's not even going to be phasing the fact that I'm not here. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> okay, y'all. Back from the thrift store. Well, I've been back. Um, but, yeah. I have been back and now I am about to actually go ahead and wash a bunch of the stuff that I got from the thrift store. It's all on the floor right now because it's about to get washed. So yeah, I just popped the tags off of everything, um, went through and wrote down um, how much I paid for everything. So that way I know how much to price everything at. So that way I know what I'm going to be getting a profit of. Um, and then after I wash everything, I'm going to sort through it again and sort the stuff that I am going to like rework and revamp and separate that from the stuff that I am not going to revamp and then I'm actually going to go online and get ready to order my steamer because I need to get a steamer um, so that I can start steaming things and I know if I order one off Amazon I can get one pretty fast so yeah. what is up you guys um welcome back to teeks week number this would make teeks week i guess i would say number 15 it is actually march the 9th tuesday march the 9th 
yesterday was actually monday march the 8th um it was women's international day but i did not vlog um me and my mom actually i don't know why i didn't vlog i should have but me and my mom actually took zahara out for the um we took zahara out for dinner for the first time it was her first little outing to dinner and she actually enjoyed it i gave her some mashed potatoes for the first freaking time and she liked them she was eating them yeah wasn't you mama weren't you eating them she's talking in the background she's in her swing um but yeah she really really enjoyed her little outing and it felt good for me to you know get dressed i did my hair i did my makeup and it was crazy because i just did my hair and my makeup and got dressed out of whim and then when i looked up i seen it was happy it was international women's day and i was like that's weird so i told my mom i was like we should go to dinner and she was like yeah like we should take the baby out and i'm like yeah that's true we should so um that is exactly what we did but update about what's been going on with us i know you guys i haven't uploaded in two weeks i actually have previous footage that i did not upload i don't probably won't even upload it um because i'm just probably not but just a brief updating about me um i know probably like on my last vlog i told you guys that we were going home and things like that but my situation has changed i am currently um just gonna be at my mom's house this is where i feel like it's best for me and zahara this is the healthiest environment for me and zahara at the moment and that is just that i'm just going to leave it there i'm not really gonna touch on my situation too much um but i just want to let you guys know that this is where we're at we are gonna be here so if you see us in the blogs and you're like oh she's still at her mom's house this is what we have going on and you know i i don't really want to touch on my situation too much i'm just ready to move forward i'm just ready to really focus on um pushing out more content because i feel like i've been doing uh, there's been just so much commotion and chaotic stuff going on that has just been causing me to not 100 percent focus on my job because this is what i do um and this is how i make my money so when i'm not 100 percent focused it just throws me off completely so, like I said, I feel like this is the best place for me and her to be at. Oh! Oh, I'm going to have a diaper to change. Girl! Oh, my goodness. But I feel like this is the best place for us to be at, um, for me, just, and having my mom here to actually help me. So, um, to help me with Zahar. So, that's what we're doing. And, yeah, sorry for, you know, being um, MIA for the last two weeks. But hopefully y'all can just um be you know be patient with me and just um you know bear with me i know y'all have been bearing with me a lot of y'all have been telling me to just focus on her and y'all are not like tripping and stuff like that but yeah i have thought about ending the teeks weeks but i'm like you know what i'm not about to do that because i know a lot of y'all enjoy seeing zahara and her journey and seeing the behind the scenes of what i got going on but i do want to continue to start hopping back into regular content as well so you'll probably see a lot more regular content um as well as me trying to incorporate still incorporate i don't know if i want to do like mm, no i probably still try to do the weekly vlogs so right now my friend actually sent me a video um about some stuff um but that i'm really really excited about um that i need to like uh research so i'm probably about to um answer my emails because i know if you've been emailing me about me trying out your products or promoting your products i have not got around to answering my emails it's been a minute so i'm gonna take time to focus on answering my emails because that's money for me um and um watching this video and taking some notes um yeah um i did put on some coffee um zahara will probably be ready to eat in a little bit she's singing sitting in her swing but i know she just do the poo, poo explosion <laughs> so um i'm gonna focus on that and then i probably only gonna spend maybe like it's like 12 30 now probably gonna spend maybe like an hour or two hours doing that and then i want to try to get out um I wanted, I wanted to try to pump out a video, so maybe I'm going to try to spend an hour on doing this because I do want to try to film another video today for my channel. So we'll see how that goes. I'm going to get ready to make some coffee, and um, yeah, I'll update y'all in a few. <laughs> y'all, she is so funny. What are you doing, mamas? What are you doing? 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you see the camera? <laughs> Let me see your feet. Let me see your feet. Y'all, she been scratching up her leg. Like, I'm like, girl, you cannot scratch up your leg like that. That's crazy. Um, yeah, they see your feet. Yeah. You have a funny swing. You need to cover up. Cover up his coat. Cover up his coat. Y'all, she do not like socks. Zahara hates socks. Um, she's about to be four months, too. But Zahara does not like socks at all. I don't know what it is about socks, but she likes her feet to be free. So I'll let homegirl do her thing. Um, and yeah, we got to figure out what we're going to do with this hair, too. Oh, I bought some new products for her as well. I'll have to show y'all um, the products that I bought for her cradle cap and her eczema. Um, they've been working really, really good on her hair. I thought about like doing a video on it, but I'm not sure yet. So yeah, we'll see. Yeah. Say, is mommy going to make you an Instagram? I haven't decided yet. I'm still like swaying back and forth on if I want to make her Instagram or not. So, but we'll see. Let's change that boo boo butt. Let's change that boo boo butt. Yes, I think that boo boo butt. Let's change that boo boo butt. Ready to change that boo boo butt? Mama gonna wear this as a cape. Mama gonna wear this as a cape. Mama gonna wear this as a cape. You done? Are you done, the boo boo wing? Huh? Oh no! Bubble explosion on the back. Oh, seven, please clean up. Lord have mercy. Sahara. Say it's the boo boo for me. It's the boo boo for me. It's the boo boo for me. Say, mommy, it's the boo boo for me. It's the boo boo for me. <laughs> It's the woo 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 wing. It's the woo 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 wing. Ain't that right? Lord! Claude, have mercy. Claude, have mercy. Lord, Lord, Lord. Cloudy, cloudy, cloudy. Okie dokie. Say okie dokie, artichoke. Whoa. That girl rolling. We gotta put some more aquaphor on your leg, girl. You've been scratching yourself up like freaking crazy. What is going on? What is going on, lady? Mommy gonna change your shirt. Mommy gotta change your shirt. Shoot. I need to get a wash rag for her. Yeah, this is the stuff I've been using on her. It's Era Orga Organic Super Bomb. I'll do like a full video, but this stuff is like really good for her eczema. It's like cleared up her skin a lot. That's crazy. I really wanted to clear underneath her neck. Um, so, yeah. Definitely going to focus more on her neck this week. I don't know. My mom gave her oatmeal bath. So, I'll probably give her one tonight. But one of her problem areas is her neck, though. Her face is cleared up a lot. And her scalp is doing, like, really, really good, too. But this is for all over the body. Yeah, you like this stuff? I know you got some eczema on your elbow and on your arm, just like mommy. And mommy had it bad on her arms. Mommy, it still comes back sometimes um, when I have little eczema flare-ups. Yeah, now you gotta clean your ears out. Clean your ears. 
I'm going to put some of this stuff on your leg, too. Cause... the 10th um i'm about to do my makeup i was just filming some tiktok videos y'all don't follow me on tiktok my tiktok is takara one but yeah i filmed the beginning of my tiktoks and then i'm gonna film i'm gonna do my makeup and do the transitions and i'm gonna try to film a how i style graphic tees um instagram video like a reel um so yeah i'm gonna start doing some more reels but i finally got sahara to go to sleep um so that I can do my makeup because she was kind of like up and kicking around um while I was filming my TikToks and then when I went to go try to film, do my makeup she was like being really fussy um didn't want me to put her down I tried to put her in her carrier carrier so that I can do my makeup she didn't want to do that either um so I finally fed her again and she is not out um and my mom came in here uh, my mom has to work a double tonight because um, somebody that she works with called off. One of her employees called off, so she came home real quick and she wanted to see Zahara and she was mad because she was asleep. I was like, don't you do it. Come below if you can relate. If you wake her up, you're going to put her back to sleep, okay? So, um, yeah, so she's asleep. Try to film my makeup real quick. She might wake up. Probably by the time I get done filming my makeup, maybe, maybe not, who knows. Um, so yeah, we'll see. But I want to do that real quick. Um, I did make a little bit of coffee, just get myself a little bit more energized. Um, I'm going to do that real quick and finish focusing on getting this content filmed so that I can push it out. I'm going to shut up because she's going to wake up. She always wake up every time I'm vlogging. So yeah, let me do my makeup. Okay. Update. Somebody is up. I was in the middle of filming the TikTok and I did not get to finish it because somebody woke up. So I just made a realistic TikTok <laughs> of me not finishing my makeup and she was in it. So, <laughs> yeah. Mwah. And I think little mama is giving mommy a booby explosion. Yeah. Yeah. Say I come first, mommy. Or get that makeup and that tutorial. Is that right? You see your TT back there on the picture? Yeah. And your toy back there too. Yeah. You hungry? I just see her. Say, mommy. She's getting another. Um. 
oatmeal bath tonight. This will be her third oatmeal bath tonight. And we're going to do a crib cap shampooing. Get that stuff together. Ain't that right, mamas? I know you can't wait for your oatmeal bath tonight. Um, I use the Aveeno. Well, I'll show y'all tonight what I use on her hair. I actually want to do a TikTok on that as well, too. But, yeah, I'll try to show y'all what I've been using on her hair um, when we give her an oatmeal bath. I kind of wanted to make a separate video for that um, on my channel. But, I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. So, yeah. You see hi to the people? We got to put you a cute outfit on, girl. No. Don't you want mommy to stay? Okay, I'm going to get back to finishing my makeup so I can finish these transitions and film this video and then i'll just update y'all later my hair is looking crazy what is up y'all it is march 15th um monday march 15th and um zahara is back here again she's watching her cartoons but um it's currently about 5 47 almost going on six me and my mom are about to take her to dinner again i'm gonna take her out again um it's like a new week, so I don't know. I'm probably going to get ready to upload this. Um, I don't know. I guess I'll upload it this Saturday um, since I didn't get... I haven't like been uploading my teeth leaks, and I'm just going to collide all the weeks together, but whatever. Um, I just really haven't been in the mood to vlog. I'm not even going to lie, but we're about to just take her to um, Panera Bread because um, my mom has a taste for Panera Bread, so do I. So I just had to pack up her stuff. Um, I packed her teething pills because she's teething and she now can take those teething pills. I just pumped some milk and put it in the bottle so that way, um, if she gets fussy or starts to get hungry, I don't have to like feed her on the boob in public. Um, because I haven't, I don't like really doing that. I'd rather have it in a bottle so I can just give it to her. Um, so yeah, me and her are kind of matching today. I have on like a white top with some, um, I just have on these sweatpants because it's Monday. I'm not getting dressed today. Um, and my Uggs. And then she has on kind of like her same outfit that I put her in um, when we went to Cheddar's. But I switched the top out. She's wearing this little top to match my sweatpants. And then she has her sweatpants on. Yeah, this is her little teething thing. Say hi to the camera, baby. Yeah, and she's just watching her cartoons as of right now. Um, so, yeah. But yeah, so I'm about to get ready to pack up our stuff in the car so that we can go, um, throw her hat on, put her in our car seat, and then yeah. What is up, y'all? Today is Tuesday, March the 16th. I just got dressed. I'm about to film some TikToks. Um, I actually just filmed a TikTok of me doing my bun, so y'all can go check that out. Um, but I'm about to fit, film some TikToks and some reels and then um, I'm about to get ready to sew up some stuff which I'm actually going to do some TikToks and reels on that. And I also want to get this newborn baby um, clothing haul video out of the way tonight. Maybe I'll do that tonight once my mom gets here so she can watch Zahara and I can actually like sit down and focus on it more because Zahara already kind of took a nap. Ain't that right? You already kind of took nap time today. Um, so yeah, that is what I'm working on right now. Just trying to film a lot of content and get content out of the way and get prepared to post some items, new items, new arrival items on time as to car. So I'm trying to balance both, trying to get both done. Um, I actually have to finish this TikTok up. Hopefully she lets me finish it. So yeah. Gonna let mommy finish the TikTok? It's just the ending part. Yeah. And I might try to film her a TikTok today too. So I've been really just focusing on filming um TikToks and reels lately. She probably gonna cry. She be crying when I put it on. She do not want me to put her down. Um, but lately I've been focusing on TikToks and reels. Okay, baby. This is my outfit for today. I know it yeah i have on this bodysuit um it's like this orange bodysuit with these jogging pants that i actually got from the thrift store these are going to go on my vintage shop and then i'm also going to be wearing this jacket with it um 
So yeah, this is going to be on the website. This is a size medium, so if you're interested in it, um, check the website because by the time you're watching this, it'll probably be up. Um, and like I said, I got to rework some stuff, but I'm going to do a reel and a TikTok on that. And y'all, I've been filming. Let me sit down right here, actually, so I can talk to y'all. I've been um, filming some reels like um so, well not reels i've been filming some tiktoks with um tzt unlimited which is my business page with my mom and my sister and i just made a new business account on tiktok for um our business page and literally it's been blowing up it's been doing so good we only have 13 followers on here and we have like over 500 views on um our videos and over 200 likes um so far and i just made this page probably i would say like a day or two ago so yeah no yesterday did i make this yesterday no a day ago yesterday so yeah and it's already doing good so i'm happy about that and i also made a tiktok for my vintage shop business page so i'm going to be um, posting some behind the scenes stuff on there as well as reels and just trying to keep up with tiktok i heard tiktok is like a really great place for businesses to grow fast um ah she just snatched my earring out um so yeah and i've been posting little uh videos of zahara on tiktok as well too and on my instagram reels so I've been just having fun on there because it's just so easy to create content and like get content up faster versus like YouTube and stuff. Um, so yeah, y'all should definitely check me out on there. We need to put some head stuff on your head, Bubba. But yeah, so I'm gonna finish um, just getting doing what I was doing. Like I said, we did go to Panera Bread yesterday. She did really good at Panera yesterday. Um, she actually fell asleep with her Baba in her hand. So uh, yeah, but. I'm just going to finish out filming and doing everything that I was going to do. Um, I need to, again, I got my, I don't know if I showed y'all my uh, steamer I got from Amazon. I need to steam some stuff too and start posting pictures on my website. And I wanted to have a sale this week. I was going to have a $20 Tuesday sale today. But I didn't get around to it, so maybe I'll do $20 Thursday or like $10 Thursday sale. I don't know. I'm thinking of one of them um, to get rid of some old stuff in my vintage shop. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to plan that out as well. I have so many things that I have to get done. It's crazy. So, um, yeah, I'm trying to do all that while balancing and having my little one. Um, but, yeah, let me finish doing this and I will update y'all in a little bit. One game is What is popping, y'all? Today is Wednesday, March through seventeenth. It's actually St. Patrick's Day. Mommy has lint on her shirt. It's St. Patrick's Day. Me and Zahara just pulled out what I'm going to cook today. I decided I'm going to cook some. I think it's called swa or sway fish or whatever. So I just said it. Alex, I'm probably gonna cook maybe some rice um, and some type of veggies or something with it for me and my mom. So, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So, we had to pull that out. It's about like four o'clock. I should have been pulled that out, but I just pulled it out. I changed Zahara because she did do a little poopy explosion on mommy as mommy was writing her email marketing. Um, I sent out a mass email for 40 percent off on my website today um so yeah i sent that out and yeah as i was seeing traffic go to the website after i sent the email out mr hard decided to do a little poopy explosion so i put the, her this little shirt that says milk naps cuddle and repeat on and then i filmed like a little um video clip of her in this shirt so that i can do a reel because i'm gonna do um there's a reel that it goes like monday Tuesday, Wednesday, I'm going to do different outfits for her. So I just filmed this one for Sunday as like a Sunday Lazy Day outfit or a Monday Lazy Day outfit. Even though I have it on, on Wednesday. Yeah. But I'm going to use that clip. So I did film that. 
um and i've been writing down other ideas for content that i want to film um for like youtube stuff my sister is actually coming in town this saturday um she'll be coming in town this saturday this weekend um to see zahara because she hasn't seen her since she was born and to um go to my grandma's grave because um my grandma finally has her headstone uh, my grandma's um death anniversary is coming up so my sister wanted to be here for that for my mom and my uncle and you know us all being together um and then um yeah she's just coming to like have sisterly time um hopefully we'll be able to do something we wanted to go to atlanta or something like that and let my mom keep her or um if i get a stroller take her to atlanta but i don't know how i'm feeling about going to atlanta now because did y'all hear about the stuff that happened in atlanta with like the mass i don't want to say it and then it centers me or whatever but which is crazy so um with the man that was doing all that stuff in atlanta at the asian shops and stuff it's crazy so yeah but i'm also boiling some water i actually have a sterilizer for my bottles and stuff i don't know if i showed you guys um and that's my little drying rack but i i don't know i just prefer to boil because i can put more bottles in a pot so i'm boiling my um water so that i can sterilize my pumping stuff because i need to pump all for the rest of the day i need to pump at least twice today um and continue to pump if i want to be able to do something do stuff when my sister gets here um because if not i won't have any milk and then i'll be bummed because i won't be able to do anything and my mom won't be able to keep her and so forth and right. so yeah i think she's actually a little bit sleepy i'm gonna put her in her um i'm gonna put her in her swing and then I haven't been able to get around to sewing any like stuff, reworking any stuff for the vintage shop, which I need to do because I said Sunday or I said tomorrow that I wanted to try to get new arrivals up, but that's not happening. So look how she's looking at me. <laughs> but maybe Sunday I'll be able to get new arrival stuff up. Um, I have some cut off denim that I need to work on. Um, I just have a lot of stuff that I need to do so yeah i um, mean i need to it's so hard to get stuff done during the day because like i said sahara still requires a lot of my attention um so i try to just get as much small stuff that i can get done as much as I can and then when my mom gets here I try to get things done at night but that's a little bit harder too because Zahara does still like to be with me she does um still like cry when I give her to my mom and things of that sort um she'll spend like a little bit of time with my mom maybe like an hour but then like she realizes that I'm off doing something and she'll start crying so yeah it's a little bit it's starting to get a little bit easier to get more things done in the day a little bit um, because she still naps throughout the day but again she still requires a lot of my attention so i know a lot of the times when y'all see me you're like well you always say that you're trying to get stuff done and y'all i'm literally trying to balance and that's i'm just i want to document the real um truth of me trying to balance it all so i do get little things done like creating reels and stuff like that like marketing and things like that so i try to do a lot of that because it doesn't require me to have to like do a lot of physical stuff um i could just be right on my phone um and planning and researching like right now while the water is boiling um i'm going to do a quick little reel for our bag business um tzt unlimited on tiktok so i'm going to do a reel for that real quick i'm probably going to try to film at least three reels real quick while i'm sitting right here I'm waiting for my water to boil and get that out of the way um and then after that i'm going to jump in the shower and i'm going to try to get out of the shower and i'm going to try to sew up these crop blazers um by that time my mom should be home i'm going to try to sew up these crop blazers um i'm probably only going to be able to do one 
crop blazer because I don't have pink thread for the other one. So that's another thing. I need to order some stuff off of Amazon. So I need to do that too. Try to do the crop blazers and then maybe I'll be able to do like a styling the crop blazers reel. Um, so yeah, and I need to... I just, I have a lot of stuff to do. So that's going to be for today, what I'm going to try to get done real quick. And yeah, I, I still, I try to do things little by little. So I still feel like I'm getting things accomplished, if you know what I mean. Um, so yeah, and I need to still film my clothing, baby clothing haul video. Like I can't, it's just too much. It's too much. But yeah, so that's what I'm about to do, y'all. And I guess I'll update y'all in a little bit because y'all always see me right here she's in her swing you in your swing i'm a swingy mommy i'm a swingy so yeah let's get this reel out of the way real quick what is popping y'all today is march the 18th um, I just got dressed. I just, well, I just did my makeup. I'm still in my chill out clothes. Zahara is actually sleeping right now. Um, she's like knocked out in the bed. Um, yeah, I don't want to wake her up. I don't want to wake her up, so let me tell y'all what I'm doing. Um, I'm getting ready to sew up some stuff. Sew up my crop blazers for my website. When I go back in the room, I'm going to be quiet. Because Zahara sleeps, she'll wake up because for some reason she can always hear when I'm talking to the camera. But I'm just working on that. I'm about to make um, a TikTok for um, the crop blazers um, in an Instagram reel. And then I'm going to go ahead and just sew those up real quick because they're really easy. Um, and then I'm going to, um, I think I'm going to try to shoot some stuff for the shop today. Um not try i need to shoot some stuff for the shop today so that way by next week i can have all my new arrival stuff up or at least by sunday i can have my new arrival stuff up so let me show y'all what blazers i'm talking about i actually got these from the goodwill i'm just gonna make them into crop blazers for the spring one first um well i'm gonna crop this one but i'm gonna sew it later because i have to go get some pink thread um to match because i don't have any pink thread to actually match so i'm gonna crop this one i'm gonna crop this one and then i'm gonna sew this one first but i want to show this one first on the tiktok so that's what i'm going to do um so yeah, that's what I'm working on right now, y'all. Um, because I've been saying that I needed to get these out of the way. Um, so that I can get them on Thomas Takara. Again, if y'all have not, let me go in here so I don't have to waste it. <laughs> Cause she will wake up. So again, if y'all have not checked out my website, um, y'all, I'm really working hard. Um, I'm about to start really going hard on the website, um, because um things have been moving a little bit slow and i need to be picking up on sales so i'm trying to just go like a different route um because i started off just doing things without like reworking and stuff and now i'm like okay i gotta work a, i gotta work harder stop being mediocre and actually like do the work like actually rework stuff and be a little bit more creative because i know i have it in me so there's no point in like being mediocre and being lazy and things like that. So yeah, y'all should definitely go check out my website. It's www.thomastakara.com. When you sign up for my email list, you do get 10% off your first order. 
um and yeah so y'all should definitely check it out tell your friends about me um you know share the site on your um tiktoks or your instagram stories um uh yeah and tag me in them so that i can reshare them on my personal page and my business page um which my business instagram page is timeless takara as well so y'all can check that out right here um and yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and work on this and um i know y'all always see me i really want some starbucks today too but yeah i'm gonna work on this for now and then um i'll update y'all in a little bit because i don't want to wake her up because i feel like she's gonna wake up um yeah oh another thing is of course when we when i moved all my stuff out of my apartment i put my mom put my mannequin in um my mom put the mannequin my mannequin in the garage so i have to get that out because i want to start using that too and here is my bar cart <laughs> yep my mom set my bar cart up here in her house too and it actually matches perfectly but we ain't gonna get we ain't even gonna get into we ain't even gonna get into that story but yeah so um yeah and i bought two swings for no big reason because now we now her has two swings so i'll probably be giving away one of her swings too because she doesn't need two swings because now she's here so yeah but yeah that's fine so i'm gonna go ahead and work on this y'all and it's sunny and nice and she's asleep and i will like So I have my sewing machine set up right here by the window. Um, I'm also forgot to tell y'all I'm going to be sewing this little paisley top. It's a really cute print. I think it'll be cute for this spring. Um, I might try to make a. I could have made like a top out of it and made it into a two-piece but i think i'm just going to make it into a her baby shark toys on the floor i think i'm going to make it into a like a cute little top crop top so y'all will see it's going to be really cute i have to either try to go to joanne's today or i might just order some stuff off of amazon so that way i don't even have to go to joanne's and do all of that because um, i need like some little cord to tie the top um to make it into like a crop top um so yeah we'll see but this is like a really cute cream color and i also bought a um i bought another little cream polo top that i'm gonna make but i think i'm gonna try to make that one into a two-piece so i don't know we'll see um, but yeah
sorry, but yeah. This is how it looks. So now it's cropped. I think now what I'm going to do is hem the edges. But super simple, super easy. And that is it. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and set this to the side and do the other blazer. I'm going to try this on too though first to see how it looks. So I am in the middle of a pumping session. I know y'all can hear the pump. of being a entrepreneur, mamapreneur. Um, so yeah, this is my second pump of the day. Yeah, second pump of the day. I heard when you pump more, um, you produce more milk for pumping and storing. So I've been setting my alarm clock so that it can remind me to sit down and pump. I just finished the first blazer. It's actually hanging up right there. I don't know if y'all can see it. And then I have to get ready to work on the second blazer, which these blazers really don't take that long. Um, I just be trying to like film and get little clips for like TikTok and all that stuff. So that's why it takes me a little bit longer. But yeah, I can't believe that this blazer up here was originally $60. This pink blazer was originally $60. Crazy. So yeah, Hara is still up there asleep. She's still not out. Um, so I'm gonna try to pump at least, try to get out five more ounces. Um, and yeah, I um, was just actually scrolling. And I was on my, um, I was scrolling on my um, Instagram my business Instagram. Somebody just texted me. I don't know who. Oh, my sister. She just texts a picture of her at work. <laughs> so cute. But yeah, so, um, this was one of the tasks that I wanted to get done today was the blazers. So I'm getting that out the way and I'm pumping. So I'm pretty proud of myself. Um, I always overwhelm myself with trying to do too many things throughout the day instead of just picking like at least one task that I just want to get completely done um I feel like when I don't pick a task to get done I end up like not getting anything done so I'm kind of glad that I'm actually sitting down doing this while oh, it's hard it's sleeping um last night for some reason homegirl did not want to go to sleep like that's probably why she's sleep right now she's been asleep for like since 12 so it's been two hours um but homegirl did not want to go to sleep last night she stayed up till like 3 a.m in the morning and i'm like girl and i was so tired and my mom was already asleep so i went and i took her in my mom's room um so that i could get some rest because i was so exhausted like she was just up staring at me i don't know what that was about zahara literally never does that but yeah so my mom took her for like an hour and I got like a little nap and then she brought her back in the room because she was crying because she wanted some milk. And so she was like, yeah, your time is up. And I'm like, I'm like, oh my God, I'm exhausted. So she brought her back in the room and she still was up. Um, and eventually she went to sleep. But yeah, homegirl was up. So that's probably why homegirl is asleep right now because she stayed up all the night. <laughs> so I just finished this blazer. Um, I have it sitting on her laundry, but yeah, at first I had cut it wrong. I didn't cut it the way that I wanted to cut it. Um, I tried to do like the little diagonals, but I didn't like the way that it came out. So I ended up cutting it shorter than I cut this one, which is fine because I like the way that it came out. Now I'm trying to decide on if I want to do raw hems. Or if I want to actually sew it. Um, 
I like how the raw hems look, but then I don't like the inside of how this is looking. So I think I might just do one little hem, um, which is going to make it a little bit shorter, but that's okay. And then, like I said, I have to go get some pink thread for this. Um, yeah, y'all, this thing is freaking, was originally $60. Let me see if I can zoom in. Those are my scraps on the ground. Let me see. Oh, I can't get it. But this thing was originally 60 bucks. It's crazy. Price tag says 60, so. Yeah. And it's a size 10 petite. It's actually really cute. And you guys know that hot pink is in for. Hot pink is in for spring season. So that's gonna be cute. This would actually be cute to like add some patchwork to it or something. Um, or like something on the back. Um, I haven't decided yet what I wanna do. Um, if I wanna just keep it plain, I think I might just keep it plain for now, but we'll see. But this one is like my absolute favorite. I'm like obsessed with burgundy. This one is a size 11. It's by a brand called Buyer 2, but I'm going to put my label in there. Um, and of course, these have to be um, steamed. Um, so I'm just going to hang this up. Let me put this on here. What's popping, y'all? I look crazy. I always say that. I always say I look crazy. I need to stop. But it is currently March. Technically, it's March the 19th, but... Because it's officially 12 a.m., it would be March the 20th, but we're just going to have like it's March the 19th, which would be Friday, even though it's currently like technically Saturday. But anyways, this is the day of Friday, um, the night of Friday night, um, going to, into Saturday morning. Um, I am currently watching YouTube videos, and I'm about to try to finish sewing up some stuff while my mom and uh, my mom's boyfriend has a car so this is a top that is going to go on my vintage shop i cropped it i don't know if i showed you guys this but i cropped it and um it's like a ladies top it's actually a size medium it's a ralph lauren top it has like the little red polo so what i'm gonna do is um cinch it at the waist with an elastic waistband so i'm just gonna sew an elastic waistband onto this and then this would just be like a brand new cute little crop top for somebody to wear um and this i think i'm going to attempt to try to make a little two-piece out of um it's like a nice little cream color ralph polo um i didn't realize that this little back part was kind of messed up but it's okay it gives it like a little i guess like patchwork kind of like I don't know little feel it's not too too bad but I think I'm gonna make try to make a two-piece out of this it's a size medium so I might be able to but we'll see um and then I have this that I want to cut up and do something cool too so I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna do with this um is that my baby Oh, <laughs> somebody's back. Somebody's back. Say, I'm back. <laughs> so, they just brought her back downstairs, but yeah. You want to get in the carrier? That's exactly why mommy has her little carrier thing on, because I'm going to put you in a carrier. Yeah. Put me in the freaking carrier, mommy, so we can get the sewing. And she got this little thing on. You want to get in the carrier? What's the matter? What's the matter? It's wrong. Or oh, you want to watch the cartoons? 
You want me to put you in the carrier? Can't drink, can't get the milk by bar right now. Mommy got milk in the freezer. Cause mommy drinking a little bit of wine. <laughs> mommy drinking a little bit of wine. So we have to make you a bar milk. Yeah. Look at her. Hara. So yeah, anyways, I'm gonna make something out of this shirt. I haven't decided what yet. And there is Mama Teeks. <laughs> So yeah, baby teeks. and baby teeks. I think she wants some food, but I'm drinking wine, so she might have to get something out the freezer. <laughs> I just got a little bit. I ain't really drunk nothing though. Yeah. I want you to check her diapers. Okay. So these are the items that I'm going to put in a bag because these are just scraps, and we don't want to waste anything because sustainability is everything. So yeah, I'm just going to put them in a little baggie. Um, I had already threaded the machine to sew through a hem for the one of the blazers. So I think I might do that first and then go over to the um, polo shirt. So me and Zahara are chilling out right now. Um, little mama, I don't think is going to let me sew. <laughs> um... So we're just chilling out. We're watching a new show that I found. It's actually a new show. I don't know what the name of it is, but yeah, I could tell she wanted me to lay down with her. <laughs> you wanted me to lay with you. She wanted me to lay down with her um, and watch it. And plus, my sister and my niece, um, her cousin, her first cousin, and her TT are coming in town tomorrow. And I have to go pick them up in the morning from the airport. Yeah, I gotta go pick them up. So I need to be getting some rest anyways because it's almost 1 o'clock and their flight gets here at 8. So I need to leave here about like 7 something. Or at least like by like 7. But I'll probably get up at like 6, go to Starbucks. And then um, head off to go get them. My mom um, said she'll go get them. But I told her I'll go because um, she asked me earlier if i would go get her in the morning go get my sister and them in the morning i was like at first i was like no because i don't know how the heart's gonna act but um i did pump milk so plenty i have plenty of milk in the freezer so and she'll probably be asleep by the time i get back um yeah she might wake up maybe by the time we get back but most likely Zahara will be asleep between six and eight so yeah by that time when she wakes up She'll get her milk and all that stuff. She'll be cool. So, yeah. But for the most part, I feel like she'll be asleep. Um, I don't even think she'll realize that I'm gone. But, yeah. So, um, if the little munchkin lets me get everything done, get anything done tonight, I might try to sew something up. But if not, I'm not going to worry about it because I enjoy these moments. And that is how it be when... You're a new mom and you're trying to, you know, work on business stuff at the same time. Sometimes you just have to take a pause and just focus on her and, you know, put everything else off. Which I'm never mad about because I enjoy spending all my little time with her. Like, me and my mom were just sitting here and she was lifting up by herself and I just started screaming. Like, I, you would have thought she was taking her first steps the way that I started screaming because... She literally started, like, you know how we, like, get up like this? She literally started lifting herself up, like, getting up. And I'm like, that is so crazy. So, I was super excited about that. I started screaming, literally. She was looking at me like, Mommy, what is wrong with you? But, like, I was just like, oh, my God, you're growing. So, just the little moments like that, I appreciate. But, yeah, I guess I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog here, you guys. Um, I'll be vlogging the whole week while my sister and them are here. So you guys will see those vlogs, clips of us next week. And yeah, hopefully y'all enjoyed this vlog. I know it was all over the place because I have different clips from all over the, from the last three weeks of me not posting a vlog. Um, so I have clips from just, just since the last vlog that you guys seen, so if it's all over the place, I apologize. Y'all know my life is just, it's just all over the place.
always right now and I'm not mad about it. Like I'm not even gonna try to fake it and make it seem like it's not all over the place right now because it is. Um, especially with me being a new mom. So, but hopefully you guys still appreciate the vlogs. A lot of y'all said y'all did not want me to stop Teak's Week. So, I'm not going to stop it because a lot of y'all said y'all enjoy it. Um, I just need to start getting more clips, I feel like, of me showing you guys. Me actually running my business stuff. Which I feel like I do show that. But, like, more like in depth, I feel like. So... Yeah, I'll probably start uploading more so of really giving more into detail of like what I'm doing because I feel like I keep a lot of like my tips and things that I'm doing um, and the difficulties that I'm going through to myself, which I shouldn't be doing. I need to be more transparent when it comes to that. Um, so, yeah, you guys can hold me to it. So, yeah, I'm going to finish the vlog off here. Since I have to get up in a few hours, um, and I'll probably, when I come back from getting them, I'll stay up and edit this. Or once, she, maybe once she falls, no, because I need to get some rest. But once we come back, um, I'll try to edit this and get this up, this vlog up. So, yeah, that'll be tomorrow's plan. So, yeah, I love you guys, and I will see y'all in the next vlog. Say bye, Carl. Say bye to the vlog. Say bye. Oh, I love you too, baby. <laughs>